and a good day. This is the discussion for the lesson 3.3. Triple integral using cylindrical coordinates. Okay, so for the review, you can just check the lecture for this lesson. Now we'll proceed for the exercises. So first, evaluate the triple integral G. Uh, triple integral under G, where G is a solid under the parabola Z equal to 9 minus S squared minus Y squared and above the plane Z is equal to 1 and the integrand is 1 over S squared plus S squared plus Y squared dTF. Okay, so first thing is to sketch the G. What is our G here? Let us sketch first z is equal to 9 minus x squared minus y squared so that is a parabolic the tip is at z is equal to 9 and hmm, at the x y plane that is when z is 0 we have x squared plus y squared is equal to 9 that is circle of radius 3 that is circle 3 Let's first draw it with dotted line. Because the solid is actually bounded above by z is equal to 1. Sorry, below by z is equal to 1. So when z is equal to 1, so let's get the intersection of z is equal to 1 and the paraboloid z is equal to 9 minus x squared minus y squared root. Let us just draw the paraboloid. Okay, so for the intersection of this, we just have to equate z is equal to 1 to this equation. So we have 1 is equal to 9 minus x squared minus y squared. Then transpose x squared minus y squared to the other side. Transpose 1 to the other side, we have 8. So this is a circle at a center that we origin with radius 2 square root of 2. 2 square root of 2 is less than 3, so it's somewhere here. Let's write here 2 square root of 2. So at z is equal to 1, we have a circle with radius 2 square root of 2. Hmm. Let's try, Let's try this one. Oh my, 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 my. Okay. Looks okay. Then. Now we darken this part. Alright, so let's just shoot this a bit. But this is out of solid tree. Okay. Apart from the solid G, we also have to sketch the projection of G onto the XY plane. So we have the xy plane here. So the idea here is to put everything under the xy plane. So kapag binaksak natin lahat sa xy plane, what will be the image? It will just be the circle centered at the origin with radius 2 square root of 2. So 2 square root of 2, this one. And we have 2 square root of 2 here. So this is our projection. Projection of G onto the XY plane. We need this for the bounds for our triple integral. So we are solving for the triple integral 1 over square root of x squared plus y squared dv. What will happen to dv if it is now on uh, cylindrical coordinates? It will be r dz dr d theta and x squared plus y squared is equal to r squared so this will be 1 over square root of r squared and then let's go first to the bounds of z we have dz here so for the bounds of z let's look at the solid g the lower bound is z is equal to 1 this one is z is equal to 1 
and the upper bound this one is the paraboloid z is equal to 9 minus x squared minus y squared which in cylindrical coordinates is equal to 9 minus x squared plus y squared is equal to r squared so this will be 9 minus r squared so we have 9 minus r squared now for the bounds of r let's look at the projection r moves from 0 to 2 square root of 2 and the theta again on the projection it moves from 0 to 2 pi so we'll circle chart. 0 to 2 pi then we're done on the setup we can now integrate 1 over square root of r squared is just 1 over r. If this is 1 over r, then we also have times r here. This whole thing is equal to 1. So if we will go into uh, integrate with respect to the z, we just get z. And if we just get z here and evaluate at 9 minus r squared and 1, we have 9 minus r squared minus 1 right so just copy dr d theta so 2 pi and 0 2 square root of 2 okay simplify we have 9 minus 1 and if we integrate with respect to r we have 8r we have negative r squared integrate with respect to r we have negative r cubed over 3 and then, uh, what do you call this? Substitute at r is equal to 0 and r is equal to 2 square root of 2. Okay. If we're going to evaluate now at 2 square root of 2, this will be 16 square root of 2. Uh, for r cube, r squared here is 8. Then times 2 square root of 2, we have 16 square root of 2 over 3. If we're going to evaluate at 0, this will just be 0. So let's not write that anymore. d theta. 0, 2, 2 pi. Okay. Lastly, integrate with respect to theta, but this is just a constant. So this will be the constant times 2 pi. What, what is this constant if we're going to simplify? This is 48 over 3, right? 48 minus 16, that is 32. If I'm not mistaken. Right? 48 yeah, 32 square root of 2 over 3. Then we have the, for the integral of d, uh, d theta, evaluated from 0 to 2 pi, we have times 2 pi here. Then lastly, simplify 64 square root of 2 over 3 pi and that's it okay let's move on to the next problem find the volume of the solid g in the first octant under z is equal to x squared plus y squared and between the cylinders x squared plus y squared is equal to 4 and x squared plus y squared is equal to 9 uh, of course, let's draw first so that we know what we are talking about. Hmm. It's easier to draw first stuff, so it is. S squared plus y squared, the bigger one first. It's equal to 9. Uh -huh. two, three. So on the xy plane, we have circles of radius 3 and 2. So it's radius 2, radius 3. Regis 3 and then Regis 2. Regis 2? Regis 2. Okay. And then. Uh, let us consider z is equal to x squared plus y squared. So at x squared plus y squared is equal to 9, the z here is equal to 9. So let's stop at 9. So 1, 2, 3, and then something. For example, this is 9. Uh, let's just try to draw the somehow parallel circle to the x-reference. 
and try to surrender. Okay. The stress estimate. <laughs> and this is the x squared plus y squared. It's equal to 4. Okay. Alright. How about the, the this one? Z is equal to x squared plus y squared. So when z is equal to 9, we have this circle. And when z is equal to 4, so we need 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. We are on the cylinder. So we have this one. Parabolic. Okay. And it says here that the solid is on the is in the first octant. So we stop here at z is equal to zero. And it is between the cylinders only. So between the cylinders and only at the first octant. Uh -huh. mm. This is difficult. <laughs> to draw, I mean. I think this is just easy, like the, the three point to draw. This is just to draw. Under, so under this parabola. Mm -hmm. mm, in between the cylinders, so we have this. So since this is under, the z is equal to x squared plus y squared. We have this one. Uh, I already understood my drawing. So it's so we have this region, and then it it follows the the shape. So para uh, Well, 